Good morning. How are you doing? It's crazy thing here, the airbrush guy. I'm still waiting on the coffee to kick in. But I'm working on it. We'll get it in, it'll start working, and everything will be just fine. <laughs> it always is. One way or the other. Trying to get going this morning. Some days are like that. I don't jump out of bed running every morning. I wish I could. That'd be nice. But some days is more work than others. But that's okay. I will get out of bed and I will get to work. Some days I just need coffee to do it. That's okay. Today, I didn't feel like fixing my hair. So I put a hat on. That's okay. You can have days like that. Hat days are perfectly okay. I'm actually, uh, speaking of hats, I'm going to give one away. By the time you see this video, it'll already be in its new home. I do giveaways on TikTok, in case you didn't know. Usually every Friday, I give some 8x10 prints away, or sometimes I'll try to pick some, some better things for the subscribers, because I have people on there. I think currently I've got 50-something subscribers. You know, so they have actually invested in me and paid to subscribe to my channel on TikTok. So in my opinion, they deserve something a little bit better. So I do give my subscribers a little more incentive. And this skull hat is actually what I'll be giving away. So if you didn't know about my TikTok, make sure you go check that out. As long as it exists anyway i will uh i will use it along with any social media that i can whether it be facebook or this youtube or instagram or my website or etsy whatever it takes we've got more hats here that i did yesterday i'd like to show you they're pretty wild and i know that getting pictures of them is going to be almost impossible so this video will be the best way to see it. This first one, he asked for the words Crypt Keeper on the bottom and skulls everywhere. So that's what I did. There's little bitty skulls on the hat inside the mouth of the big skull. The skulls go all the way back into here. I know the camera won't pick them up very well, but they are little bitty. For the one big skull here, I put a fish skull on it just to be different with a bat skull on the back and look at there a big bird skull on the side I know it's got a lot of fuzzy on it but this guy is amazing he's been ordering hats uh, every month or two, he'll order another hat or two. And uh, he's got quite a collection going so far. And uh, I'm honored to be able to do that. <clears throat> Repeat customers like this, I said it before, they are the foundation of my business. I'm always trying to reach new customers, new clients. I'm always trying to impact new people with my artwork. But it's the ones that keep coming back. That's the foundation. I need those repeat customers laying down that foundation so that I can reach out there to more people. So this is an you know, anxiety awareness hat is what I like to call it. He didn't call it that, but I did. It's got the brain on top surrounded with like a teal lightning. Cause of that constant stimulation that comes with anxiety so that's a pretty good fit right there. I like the symbolism. Brains, brains. Everybody needs more brains. <laughs> and uh, that's all I got done yesterday. Believe it or not. Didn't get a lot of shop time. Kids home and stuff in the summer. But uh, I'm gonna be out here today creating some new pieces to put on my Etsy page for stock. Isn't he cute? 
He's shipping out this morning. I thought you might want to get one last glimpse. <laughs> I just made that. Oh, what, two days ago? And it's sold already. It sold, that sloth sold within, what, three, four hours of posting it on my Etsy page. So it's that kind of feedback that I need. And it's that kind of feedback that I'll use to know what to make next. That's the wife's. You can't have it, but I can make you one. Goodies everywhere. So guys, if you need anything, you know who to call or text or message me. Message me on Facebook, message me on Etsy. If you'll message me on Etsy, I guarantee you get an answer because I get an email and a notification my wife Beth gets an email and a notification and it keeps us on a, a five star rating if we respond quickly. So I prioritize those Etsy messages. So make sure if you really need to get a hold of me, that's the best spot. But for now, I'm going to go get some more coffee and get it. Well, get some more coffee in me so that I can get going, get my energy level up where it needs to be. Not that it takes a lot, but. I need to get going, get to work, get busy, get to making some money, get to create some stuff for you. And guys, I'll see you in the next one.